Almost. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, it feels good, actually. It's, you know that sting you hate, which you love? Yeah. Cotton balls was a poor choice for this. Gauze pads would have been better. I don't have them. Oh, we're already into this. Well, that's a good note to remember, you know. Next time. Okay. Don't use cotton balls on something that can... Well, because this has... This is a really interesting... Did it burn? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. This Camera is... picking it up. Hmm? Camera picking it up. Yeah, let me zoom in a little bit. Mm -hmm. Don't use cotton balls. Use gauze because the fibers in the cotton balls get cotton in the morning. Oops. Uh -huh. Just kidding. There we go. You can zoom in too. I did zoom in. I adjusted it. The thing is, you know, I've been rolling around and you caught on thinking that my, my pack strap rubs it and really gives me fits with it. Okay, this is going to burn. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to see how much is left in here that's attached to your skin. It is, it's quite a ways off of your skin. Right. So I could possibly cut it off. Yeah. It's going to hurt. Okay. Very badly. Because it is very attached to you. Should we pause the video and put some lidocaine on it? It's probably, yeah, I would probably do that because this is, I mean, it's quite a ways off of there. My head keeps getting into the camera here. Does it hurt when I move it? No. What an interesting little thing this is. Fascinating. Because it looks, it's like interesting. God, it's neat. I'm kind of sick. Okay. You um, use your tweezers. So one side is going to be easy to remove. Yeah. This side over here is a little more attached, but I think I could probably take it off. So if you want to pause this. Okay, we're back. Good razor blade up there in case the scissors don't jazz. Oh, the scissors are gonna work. I 
I do have to say this lidocaine is not exactly the best. There's no instructions to tell you how long to leave it on, what are you doing. And no instructions in the box. I have the instructions right here. Oh, okay. So we'll look up lidocaine on the uh, internet Interwebs. for future use. Feel it? No. I can feel it when I start cutting into it. You can feel it pulling still a little stingy. Is it stingy? A lot less than it was. Would you like me if it's more on it? Yeah, a little more. Not apparently, but your sister used uh, <coughs> lines to come down. Do another box of these. Only real problem we're having here is just locating stuff. You know, I'd hate to have had this be a gunshot one and say, Whoa, where is this and where is that? Should be a lot more at the ready. I'm hunting packs out, you know, stuff. Ooh, that's numb, all right, boy. <laughs> Is it numb? Oh, man, alive. I hope so. It's so numb I can feel it. I hope so, because I'm going to be, you know, cutting it from your body. Right. All right. You ready? Ready. Main frame. You can turn that screen to wherever you want to. I got it. Here we go. Let me know if I you can feel this or if it hurts. Right. It's stingy, but it's not, you know, sending me through the roof. Yeah, because I'm literally cutting your flesh right now. Not too bad. There is some blood. Right. Pretty like a splinter. <laughs> Holy smokes! Well, well, good job, Cinderka. <laughs> What's the wound look like? It's a hole. You can see where, like I said, these cotton balls are a very poor idea for next time. It looks like you can see where it was attached, of course. Right. Um, there is some bleeding. My gauze pad out here. I'm 
going to put some rubbing alcohol on it because okay. I may feel some sting. So, zero out the rubbing out. Cotton ball's bad. Gauze good. Gauze good. There's no fibers. Also, have your stuff ready, ready. at hand. Not in packs and bags. Boxes in the bathroom. Boxes, yeah. Okay, this is going to burn. May burn. You're going to lie no. to Caney. Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Good. I can feel you hitting a hole. Oh yeah, there's no lidocaine in there. I'm very surprised that it doesn't hurt. Yeah, no, you I can mean, see I can where. Feel it like if you're hitting, you know. Yeah. Like a pothole in a road. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I don't feel nothing. Good. Lidocaine works. This is gonna bleed for a while. It looks like a mole, and I think that's what it was. Not a mole, but I'm sorry, a wart. Where's your tape at? I'll start digging tape out. And... I don't want tape on there. Okay. I do need you to get that box of gauze pads back up. And... Open up a couple more? Uh, one more, and then I'll need one for your bandage. Let's try to get the bleeding to stop a little bit. things will bleed for a while. Right. But you see what I said, it mostly get, got knocked off last night. Mm hmm It was, it's like you see, it's quite large, but you can see where it stuck up from the actual skin. Right. So it was actually like, it probably would have come off eventually. You would have pulled it off. Right. Lidocaine works. That's good to know. Yes, it is. I would definitely recommend taking that into and be like, uh... Right, I cut this up on body last week. Body. Can you tell me what it is? I wonder if I should put an alcohol or something. Alcohol might eat it. Water? Eh, I don't know what water. Right. Press it in the pages of a book like a flower? This is going to bleed for a while. Really? Mm hmm At least they'll bleed for a while. Pause the video. Okay. Okay, we're back now. Band-aiding. It's still bleeding. It's going to bleed for a while, but we'll keep it bandaged. I have more. I'll clean this 
and we banded it before I leave. Right. That way, and it should be clotted enough. Just make sure that you keep it clean so you don't get an infection. Lessons learned. Prepare your medical stuff more. Your surgery site better. But we did pretty good. Yeah. That looks horrible. This is the side that was actually on you. Right. You can see because this is all blood clotted. Let me just hold it, hold it. Go ahead and explain that. So this is the area that was actually still attached to the skin. This is where it had come off. You can see all of the dried up blood. Right. This is where we removed it from the body. Yeah, that's horrible. We'll save that for the old doctor at the VA. There's no telling what's going on with it. But it had to come off. And people say, oh my God, didn't you wait? And no, we can't wait. Can't go to the old uh, emergency, you know, Saturday, it's 100 miles away. That kind of thing, and just think about it. That's what would happen. All right. Are we done? We are done. We're done. Live by your wits, not by your worries. Peace. Bye. And everybody thank the surgeon. Surgeon. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs>